What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Been a long time since we've gotten out on a trail. Got the Marlin Crawler kit installed. It's cold out. We're doing a shakedown run at Hackett Gulch today. See how it goes. So far, truck feels really good. The RCLT kit is eating everything up with the locked off road shocks and bypasses. Um, I think I am going to revalve the coilovers to be a little bit softer and then valve the bypasses to be a little bit softer and basically make the bypasses do all the dampening. But so far, the truck feels really, really good. I do miss the power brake big brake kit right now, but that'll be back on in about eight weeks. I'm just happy these guys got this thing up and running as fast as they did because this is a blast. You guys see this, but nobody's been here, so we're That's breaking cool. trail. Oh, and we're sideways. Fresh, fresh snow. Let's go. Oh, oh, oh. Come on, grip. There we go. That's what you want, Mickey T. And this is how you know it's good snow wheeling. So we've been breaking trail and you can see I have no more, no wheels anymore. My camera can't even focus because it's so bright out, but yeah. Joel has been eaten by the ditch. Bring it at me, bruh. We're gonna have to turn passenger as soon as we start getting the groove. So we need to hit drop. Go, 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 go. All right, Joel is in a ditch. Yes, sir. So he's gonna lose some tire pressure because he did not air down. He's gonna go down about 15 or 12 PSI. And I think we're gonna get him some traction boards. Here comes our muscular hero, Cannon Counts, with four traction boards looking like Hercules going through the fresh powder and not the already tired out tracks. He said, that's for pussies. I'm taking the fresh stuff because I'm a real man. Yeah. But he brought four boards from my truck, so we're good. Operation Save Joel. Oh, God. <laughs> All right, time to hook up the ink rope to the Rock Runner C4 bumper and give the supercharger the beans and pull Joel up. Hopefully, we'll see. I'm gonna air down a little bit more, cheat codes. Oh. 
the yeah. fuck it is. Damn. Part of wheeling. Really, you need some tri-acting? Yeah. Some what? Take some tri-acting. Mm. Tri-acting like a man. <laughs> so I don't know if you guys heard, but Joel snapped a CV. It's broken pretty good. So he's in two-wheel drive. <coughs> Dang. So we got him with a kinetic rope strapped to Austin's Tundra to get him out, make sure they get out, because he's in two-wheel drive now, so we're gonna start heading back. I know for a fact Joel's booty was puckered right here. Dang! Poor guy sideways the whole way through. <laughs> well, it's been a while since I've done one of these videos. Um, hope you guys liked it. We're gonna call it a day with Joel breaking his CV axle. Um, I'm gonna head home, spend some time with the wife and baby. Marlin crawler kit with the locked off road shocks was amazing. I really liked it a lot. Um, where some people were going like 10 or 15, I was doing like 30, 35, so very nice. I am gonna revalve the bypasses uh, to soften up a little bit because I'm gonna do more slow rock stuff than go fast stuff. But so far the Marlin Crawler kit is really well put together. I'm really happy with how the Mickey Thompson all terrains, I mean the mud terrains performed. Um, they just ate through that snow pulling Joel up the hill. I have to say I'm very impressed with them. They were at about 10 PSI, but yeah, overall the truck just feels really, really good. Kevin's window's down, so that's probably what you guys are hearing. Um, but the truck feels really good. So just a couple fine tunes and tweaks. And I think it's gonna be dialed. We gotta box the frame in. I might do a nine inch rear and a link in the three link in the rear. But Marlin Crawler kit is phenomenal. Very well thought out, nice geometry. Definitely not worried about spindles ever again, but yeah, if you guys need any work done to your truck, check out True Automotive in Denver. They do all the work on the truck. Um, wiring is all by Mitchell Blaze Off-Road, but other than wiring, True Automotive does all of it. The long travel, the supercharger, the front bumper, all that stuff is all them. Um, if you have any questions, leave them down in the comments, but until next time, peace.